there are a couple of keyboard shortcuts that you can use to create a chart in Excel. So we'll take a look at what those shortcuts are and how you can control the appearance of the chart that is created with those shortcuts. So the first one, I have a table of data here. And if I select any cell in that table and on the keyboard, press the F11 key, it inserts a new sheet in the workbook. So here's chart seven sheet and it used all the data from that table where I had selected a cell. So if we go back to that order sheet, if I only want part of the data, I can select the date headings here and I'll hold the control key and then just pick the quantities for that date. And now if I press F11, only that data is in the chart. Now if we go back to orders, so I've still got that data selected, instead of creating a new chart sheet, I could press the Alt key and F1, and that puts the chart right on the worksheet where the data is. And I'll just delete that. Those were column charts because that's the default chart type that I'm using. And if I go to the insert tab here, I can see charts and there's this little button at the bottom right corner. If I click it, it launches this window where I can see all the different chart types. So this is the one that is the default right now. If I usually make a line chart, I can click on line, then pick my line chart that I'd like to be the default. So I'll select this first one, click set as default chart, and then I'll just cancel out of here. So I still have the same data selected. And now if I press F11, it creates a line chart for me. So with those keyboard shortcuts, you can quickly create a chart either for the whole data table or just the data you've selected using your default chart type.